This is Zach Newman with Mizzou Virtual Reality and Vox Magazine. When refugees and speakers of Swahili and other African dialects want to worship in their native tongue in Colombia, they go to the First Baptist Church. Pastor Nene Peter, one of the leaders of the congregation, says the weekly service makes a positive impact on the community. Because it was common, some people with refugees here, and uh, we want uh, to praise God and uh, worship God like I was worshiping in my country. Yeah, in Africa, this is how we have a church here to pray in our language. Uh, it's totally different, you know, like a first Baptist. They don't dance, but as we dance, we praise. Yeah, it's different. I believe the Bible is the same. But uh, how we do services is different. But uh, First Baptist was telling us, come, enjoy, do what you do in your country. We say, God, what's those? God is that day, night. When there was an attack in our village, God will save me. Let me tell him, God, thank you. You know, we have many people suffering in a camp right now. Some have HIV, some no food. No clothes. We want to pray for them. Maybe God can open a way for them. Our country can be peace, they can go back, or God can give another way to come. Yeah, it's like a family. Yeah, it's like a family. Yeah. It's a family but a different uh, country. <clears throat> From Burundi, Rwanda, Congo, Kenya, Sudanese. Even some Tanzanians they come here. I have many people here, they like to walk, but they know English. But they want to walk, they are hard worker, they, want, they need to walk. That is the problem here. Yeah, to, uh, to teach them how to drive. It's many times, you know, there some people come here, even to turn on uh, micro, they don't know how to use. Even the bathroom, they don't know how to use it, but it's good to help them, to show them, this is this one, this is this one. We need more people to help because every month we receive refugees. It's good to help them and uh, uh, to teach them the culture for America. We need to learn American culture. We need to know how America works.